a job where you can really find joy and passion in. But it's a job that no one tells you to like go for, right? I think it's important for the next generation to know that there are many aspects of forestry and urban forestry that you can be involved in. Urban forestry is important because trees provide many benefits for the city, including improving people's health, both physical and mental health. Um, it improves air quality and they also provide economic benefits like they make cities more attractive so it, it encourages people to come here and visit. You have a lot of variety and different things you want to do like if you want to work outside as an arborist or like inside you can also do like environmental education. Urban forestry is very beneficial because of the opportunity to work outside with others who know about trees and the environment. When I think of like both the social, the economic and environmental impacts that forestry carries with it, I think it's really important to have well-informed environmental stewards that know how to manage this resource, especially when you're looking at things like climate change and climate adaptation. Young generations are going to be tasked with figuring out how to live in a really rapidly changing world and how to manage those natural resources. Part of the Austin Civilian Conservation Corps internal city pathways to employment, the forestry pathway reduces barriers into forestry careers, building a network of support and provides hands-on experience, training and mentorship. Projects on public land include planting, restoration and maintenance of natural areas, forest health analysis, invasive species mapping and environmental education. It's such an important um, program because it's generating those pathways into urban forestry jobs for folks that look like me, for folks that are unsure about what they want to do. Essentially, gathering people that might not have an opportunity to be in the world of urban forestry and giving them those opportunities because it only it starts with that one opportunity, right? The model gives an opportunity for young people to um, engage with all kinds of city staff members as well as representatives from some of our partner groups. It gives them an opportunity to explore all these different angles from which you could enter it as a career. And then what we're trying to develop are the opportunities, the connections, the network that can help them dive into the field at the point at which they're interested and hopefully find full-time employment doing that thing that they've discovered they would really love to do. At the beginning of the year, I didn't know anything to do with trees or forestry or you know, just having the knowledge of different careers within the city that, that has to do with trees. Um, but within that year, I learned a lot, how to prune, how to cut, how to diagnose trees if they're sick. I also advanced and upgraded my communication skills. But yeah, I've definitely evolved and better than I was a year before. I really liked being an intern in the Youth Forest Council because I got to learn more about the urban forests in Austin and equity. I really liked being able to complete a community action project and learn about community engagement. It was really nice to do projects within the city that improve and support our urban forest. Some of my favorite projects that I've done as an intern in the Youth Forest Council is helping review grant applications for the Urban Forest Grant. I also really enjoyed being involved in the planning of the Roots and Wings Festival as well as completing my community action project, being able to engage my community and create something that um, lasts for years to come. ACCC is that stepping stone. It is literally that motivation and that help to do bigger and better things um, in the world of forestry or urban forestry.